An update on the News for Jack's I-Team investigation into the death of a 14-year-old shot and killed in her mother's home. Police say Ava Guthrie died in January after a gun her mom was holding went off. They said her mother took the gun from the teen before it fired. 34-year-old Amanda Guthrie was charged with aggravated manslaughter of a child and with child neglect. News for Jack's I-Team investigator Vic Michelucci uncovered a new document from her defense attorney, which claims the gun went off accidentally into the ground and ricocheted. Oh, God. <sighs> we heard from Ava Guthrie's devastated father and grandfather after the shooting. The 14-year-old shot and killed in her mother's Arlington home in January. Her mom, Amanda Guthrie, claiming it was an accident when she took the weapon from her daughter's hands. What do you think about that word, accidental? As a gun owner, you don't accidentally pull a trigger pointed at another human. You just don't. That's not, that's just not an accident. Five months later, Amanda Guthrie is on house arrest, confined to the same home where it happened. She has no comment, but the I-team discovered her lawyer has a new defense. So in my mind, this goes from just an accident to a freak accident. And I no longer feel that Miss uh, Amanda Guthrie uh, was negligent here. Defense attorney Richard Landis hired a forensic consultant, Michael Knox, who released this report. He writes that he analyzed crime scene evidence, recreated the incident, and believes that the bullet that killed Ava bounced off the floor, saying the firearm was not directly aimed at Ava Guthrie, but was rather pointed at the ceramic tile on concrete floor resulting in a bullet deflection. You do not think your client was negligent? When a child, which is what we have here, had a gun in her hand, if a parent takes that gun from the child and there is a, an accidental discharge, uh, that to me is that parent being responsible, not being negligent. Where was she keeping the gun? The gun was on an armoire, a high piece of furniture in her bedroom behind some pictures. It was not out in the open. It wasn't locked away, but that's where it was. I called Ava's father, Aaron Beezer, and I sent him this new report. He had not heard of it yet, but when he read it, he told me this. I stand by my interview with you. I don't believe any of this is an accident, and you don't shoot my daughter in the head on accident. You just don't. May the state be heard. Beezer hopes Guthrie gets serious prison time. Her attorney says he thinks the state should drop all charges against his client. Vic Michelucci, Channel 4, the local station. We reached out to Michael Knox about his findings, but an associate said he had no comment.